if the man likes let him cheat as long as i am the number one i am the madam of the house it doesn't really matter now that is one of the comments i saw in the previous video i made about cheating but now let me tell you one thing that you are ignorant of even you ladies who are not married yet who have the idea that even when i marry and my husband is a cheat it doesn't really matter let me tell you the implications of a cheating partner the first thing is affection now naturally a person cannot be affectionate to two people equally at the same time even the bible says that you cannot serve two masters at a time it's either you will love one and hate the other or hate one and love the other and this also applies to love and affection in a relationship either that man loves you more than the person outside or he loves the person outside more than you and guess what most of the time that person outside receives more of the love even than you at home that's why the person will even look outside in the first place as affection is being shared in this manner so also is attention because there is you at home and there are other people outside definitely attention will also be shared that's why you begin to complain that the partner is not spending much time at home doesn't even pay attention to your needs to your desires and all that that's simply because attention now is being divided and there are other people outside who are even gaining more of the attention then as attention begins to divide resources also begin to divide so normally the husband that before we give you enough money to take care of yourself and the children now will now begin to tell you there is no money they did not pay us business is not good and all that simply because now there is now a sharing of resources between you and between the madam outside or the madams outside so even your children begin to suffer whatever it is around you begins to suffer because as much as affection attention and resources are being shared your children will not have the maximum of their father now it's only natural that because of these shared resources and shared attention and affection that you now begin to feel bad and you begin to complain so normally as the man comes to the house you begin to tell him your mind and say you are not happy with what's going on and then trust me by the time you now begin to complain they will now start tagging you a nagging wife Gradually, the man even begins to avoid coming home at all and even when he comes he now resorts even to beating you up because he thinks that now you are nagging and so gradually abuse now begins to come domestic violence now begins to come you can see that cheating is not just cheating there are so many fallouts there are so many things that comes with a cheating partner i've seen in many cases that domestic violence has even led to the death of a woman not once not twice it's all over the internet so you accepting the idea that it's okay for a man to cheat as long as he's kind enough not to let me know that he's cheating or know the person who is cheating with it's okay you can see that that is just a delusion because in the end there are so many dangerous things that can come out of a cheating partner which is not what anybody should want or should dream for him or herself because a cheating partner is a disaster waiting to happen and trust me that disaster will definitely happen yes look at my face i say it will definitely happen